Everybody's getting yeah. it, James G will even yeah, jack right. Cause I'm a beast on the track, when I fucking rap Okay, yeah. enough of this garbage, I'm causing a carnage I'm shooting the barrage, I'm seeing the cabbage on this bastard uh -huh. steady. What's good ladies and gentlemen, it's your boy Shell T And you know what's up guys, it's night so I can't scream I can't scream, I can't scream But we're about to react right now to King Kaka This, song, this is long overdue, I have done this like 3 days ago So King Kaka dropped a, a song Title Ganji, I was told there's a song that every African can relate to. So we're about to check it out now, guys. So please hit the subscribe button. Don't forget to share. Don't forget to like, leave a comment. God bless you guys. God bless. Let's go. Shuni Shishi. Eight out of ten graduates are jobless. Crazy. Ganji, a Kaka Empire presentation. <laughs> Kaka Empire is the lifestyle. I'll get mentioned on my way. Oh shit! Turns out somebody is sick, right? Like somebody is sick at his own. I think that was his mom who was chatting. Mom, I'll get mentioned on my way home. So he's t t telling his mom, I'll get mentioned on my way home. Right? Yeah. But there's somebody with a gun there waiting to rob him. Crazy. <laughs> Empire is the lifestyle. Damn. Fun music. music. Mm. Okay. Okay. Your money or your life, nigga. Buddha, ah, uh, I just stuck it with quick beer. I drew a when he hustler, so Buddha joy is here. But since, since we all here, need me grow. Nele kizazi ya no fear Hakuna jani kuja kwa mlangu wako kukubishia So sai, nipate tu ganji mente share Okay, so he's saying bro, I'm sorry, I don't mean to rob you But situation has brought us here And since we are here, let's get about our business Be a good customer, cooperate And let this business go on smoothly Right, let's go Nipate ganji mente share Buddha Nipate ganji mente share Mzai, ndo ni meanza job two days ago Na trek ni save, ndo ni ngienda ni slando Nili bribe ni pate job jo, true kim chango Mada ni musi Fuck, fuck I bribed to get a job through a fundraiser Do you know how poor you have to be? How desperate you have to be? Not just to give bribe to get a job But to have to get people like a big move that contributes Right, like people contribute for you to get the money to pay the bribe to get the job. That is a different level of desperate, guys. For real. Take a cup and let down door. Say Japan the mad ni save. Don't him buy your dawa. Hoping manze. Vitu sta kwa saw. So you watch your ganja to share. Please manze, you watch your ganja to share. Kill um to an asida na yako staki kuskia. The facts bro, everybody has a problem. Alright, now the guy uh, who's just coming from work has a serious problem. Uh, he's not going to play with his mother's health, right? Like he doesn't want her to die. Mr. Robert too has a problem, man. He just wants the money. In his mind, he's doing what he needs to do to survive. He's taking a huge risk, putting his life on the line, right? In my country here, it's a if you armed robbery, you get shot on the spot, right? If you make it to the courts, minimum of twenty years, minimum. Right? So yeah. That's a huge risk you are taking. And then for someone this smart, who doesn't want to do this? Yeah, the problems we brought you here. So Please man, you know check and you mean to share. Kill a mtu ana shida na yako staki kusikia. Hata ukini show nini? Si ati nitasusia. Imagine. Aikuwa hii yangu career. Vile unanicheki hapa nina degree ya engineer. Why for no fool? Na mtu Fuck. So this wasn't my career. I should I just see me here with this gun being an armed robber, a professional armed robber, <laughs> trying to rob you of the money and just do my job professionally. Uh, yeah, I studied engineering in school, or right? I have a degree in engineering. But my wife is at home, no food, and my child is sick, just like your mom is sick. <laughs> Yeah, 
844 system. Is it talking about the schooling system, like the education system? Let's go. To make grow from the same struggles. Come and copy and our gondi. What my son? Who's in them gondi Buddha? He said, Don't call me a thief for crying out loud. My homie, you're a thief, man. It's the situation, but it's, but it's, what, it's what it is, man. It's what it is. You're a thief. The Seko, Manisha Quita, if you're the Mona to me, I get to Una Caribisha Kif, Nikona Panchapo, Labian Kupeki, so Kwasai, Noche to Ganjamin, they share. Noche to Ganjamin, they share. Bro, it's just real. I love this concept, man. I love this concept. I love this concept, bro. I love this concept. Talking about real struggles, man. Real struggles. I love this. This is mother's concept. I love this. Oh yeah, oh yeah, Buddha. Buddha, watch your father. But you know, you're my paro and you spend those sana. Ili fika point me now out to get close sana. I'm depressed, bana. Ni mo na sara iyo do ya chuo. Wange ni pe ni fungo blessara. Bro, sometimes I feel like um the um those Igbo guys that don't go to school um they do business instead. Like I f I feel like. Like they got one on us, man. Like when I when I when I say that, I mean that in a positive sense. Like you go to school, you spend so much money going to school, and you come out no jobs. All right, but all the while you were in school, four, five, six years, seven years in school, these guys were hustling. All right, maybe they probably didn't spend no capital. Started off being um, what do they call them, apprentices, and then from there they had their own stuff. So when you are out of school, this young man has a house, has a car. Has his own business and you are looking for a job to pay you minimum wage fuck bruh let's go bana ni mona tara yo do ya chuo wange ni pen fungo biashara i don't need my dropouts ni on my dossi me na bigri yangu sina ms the irony the, the dropouts are the rich guys on god bro on god on God, not necessarily dropouts. The ones who did not take the academic seriously, right? Focused on making money. Those ones are the rich ones. Now you're not saying, you're not saying, um, uh, one bad one. We're not saying um, academics fucks you up that bad. What we're saying is, the the way the system is, the way the whole system is. Those who focus on making money, make money. Those who spend their time in academics will need a lot more time. So you can't the time you spend you can't get it back and, and you have nothing to show for the academics for the for the for the school you went to if you don't get a job so what do you do you are starting afresh while you when your mates are already gone ahead at a point when you are supposed to uh uh be handling responsibilities in life so it's a fucked up situation Na jo nani ako na gun pia nani ako na njora Lakini, ni me decide vile future nta ichora Wejua, kwanza I'm the only son Ni me raise you on a single mom At least ni mfraishe pony Ni achi tu mom Ni achi tu i ganja minta ishia Sita sema ni achi tu ganja minta ishia Bro, it's crazy It's crazy This one on this side, fighting for his mom's life This one on this side, fighting for his daughter's life, right? And his wife's happiness. It's crazy. Right? And the thing is, if, if we have to be honest with ourselves, yes, the, our governments mess up, mess us up on various levels. I agree. But then there are decisions we have taken or have not taken along the way that lead you to where the one with the gun is. Like, like the guy on corporate where I said, he said he knows someone with a gun with a dagger but he has decided to shape his life decisions decisions all right so well, i'm not saying if you're poor it's your fault i'm saying um there's always something we can do to help ourselves as opposed to um crime all right let's go let's go it a bidin in me decide it a bidin in me decide buddha pole bro Osiam toy, one and go to Palido. The government, my cousin, Jonanga Isha. Nah, 
ni nini anga inaisha wacha mtoya live madako ashaona maisha let my child leave your mother's ready experience life bro is that how we're judging this shit now <laughs> is that how we're judging this shit now if we, well let's, let's go on let's go on let me not make a case for you right guy but let's go on let's go on this is a point of life and death and uh basically survival of the fittest it's not about right or wrong it's not about when you are faced with a life and death situation then you know that the law has little power in that situation at that point in time there is no morality at that point in time all there is is who who, who survives and who does it that is all there is at that moment lazima to choose at a kama na chechisha it was nice when it lasted there real life situation man real shit oh he bought the drugs who shot who now hold up <laughs> somebody let me know what happened man the the, the guy with the the uh, corporate uh where did he shoot the uh guy who had the gun as in was he strapped the whole time was he maybe one of those guys who, who won't be caught like let me know what you let me know what you think guys because he obviously brought, brought the drugs for his mom let's take that again Man, my name is it was nice while it lasted what happened to what because the guy had his hands on his head so there's no way he pulled out a gun unless somebody shot the criminal guy from the back or the criminal guy did not shoot at him one or two but anyhow um the corporate guy eventually came home with the drugs that's what we can see But this is real shit, guys. Real shit. Real shit. Real shit. So thank you all for viewing. God bless. MC Waku Amesoma Abba. Waku Amesoma Ama Amepitisha B. What does that mean, guys? What does that mean? Pizzo on the track. I'm the one that make him run. I'm the one that drop it hot. Fuck with me and you get shot. They can get me if they plug. I'm the baddest of the lot. I'm the baddest of the lot.